Well, you know, there's a variety of different type of fire truck manufacturers. There's big ones, small ones, and even little tiny ones. And this is something of a little unusual here at SirenNet. This is a fire truck in the making. And for those of you who can guess what it is, I guess you win the prize. But essentially, you're looking at the very basic beginnings of a very special fire truck for a very unique fire department here in Oregon. Dundee Fire and Rescue were the proud recipient of a brand new response unit. And there it is inside its particular location at the station. A little bit on the small side, I guess, compared to the larger rigs around it, but it is definitely something that the guys will, and gals would be proud to respond with. It has the special designation BBQ3, for those of you who are non-American, that means barbecue three. Um, the vehicle itself has a variety of lighting put into it, as you can see here as the camera swings around. All of which, by the way, is fully functional. The unit itself was built with a tremendous amount of passion and love by a company called Precision Metalworks in Newburgh, Oregon, which is a town next to the city of Dundee. And a gentleman by the name of Ron Booth in fact, is the owner, entrepreneur of that particular company. And they built this particular piece of equipment for the chief of Dundee Fire Department, John Stock. So a very, very nice piece of equipment indeed. We'll be going to many a barbecue as a fundraiser in the local community, as well as the local high school and grade schools, and all of the sort of charitable events that fire departments are always proud to take part in in their respective communities. The unit itself has a Unitrol 200 watt siren unit. This is actually an original Unitrol, by the way, um, which of course Federal Signal acquired from Dumbo Nun several years ago now. But the unit is fully functional, and by turning on the respective uh, slider there, as you just saw, that then in turn activates the different lighting on this particular piece of equipment. The unit itself has a self-contained battery system that is fully independent, so it will run for numerous hours. It also has a headlight furniture included in there, which, by the way, is halogen, and they will deactivate that when they're running this at the particular event because the halogen, alas, will create too much of a draw on the battery system. Otherwise, everything else will run fine for hours. Also has a fully activated siren system as well. Now, they won't use that, of course, when they're at the barbecue, but maybe responding to the scene. The unit itself is fully legal here in the United States to be towed behind a piece of apparatus, so they can do that. And right now you can see into the cab there with this particular shot, there is in fact Lexan or Perspex windows which are gonna be put into this vehicle, which will fully enclose it. But we got a chance to take a quick sneak peek inside. Access, by the way, to the electrical panel is through the front engine area there. And here is the barbecue itself in action with respect to how it works. There's a variety of levers and wheels. The wheel basically hires and lowers the actual barbecue area itself. That's where the coals would sit. So by going up, increases the heat. By going down, decreases the heat. There's a quick look inside the firebox area. And as you can see there, there is a valve that's been set up very nicely that coordinates airflow into the actual barbecue area and the fire pit area itself. By turning it down, you basically reduce the amount of airflow, close it off completely, or open it up, depending how you want to do that. So again, a very unusual piece of equipment for us here at SirenNet, something that the folks at Precision Metalworks really did a brilliant job with. And I know they are looking for other customers, so contact SirenNet, we'll put you in contact with them. This might be something that your department might have an interest in. Well, there you have it, the Dundee Fire Department's brand new Barbecue 3. I'm Stuart, and you've been watching Sarnet Television.